Okay, so today we're off to go visit Education Plus. They're a, a group who work in one of the poorest areas in one of the poorest countries in all of Central America. So this is the level of the highest uh, kids who've got all of these issues such as street kids, they become criminals, a lot of prostitution. The youngest uh, teenage parents in all of America there. So looking to see how we can help them out, um, how we can really just you know, make a little bit of a difference there. They um, provide schooling, they provide education, food, everything for these kids. And so gonna be meeting with a guy called Jim. Um, he's the director. Oh, grandfather, won't you help me sing this song? Oh, grandfather, help me move along. Move along with these chains We're dragging behind our feet Born in the roots of a white ancestry Oh, Grandfather, won't you share your wisdom with us? Well, there we are Gather the children around these chains yeah. Watch them fall to the ground Unlock the shackles with the prayers of our sound Grandfather, how you help the people find the food on the land? Grandfather, to the hardest seasons, come in your hand. Oh, Grandfather, all of the nations once again resound with the pure heart of feeling gathering around, gathering around these chains and watch them fall, fall, fall. Uh, our ultimate goal really is that some of these kids do go off to university and they come back with their degree in teaching or social work or administration. They take Julie's job and my job and Monica's job. Mm -hmm. And then we have Nicaraguans helping Nicaraguans and we'll go yeah. full circle. And we'll have completed our mission here mm -hmm. at the very best. Uh, but first of all, you know, I like to say we have four components. And the first one being nutrition and health. They can't learn if they're hungry. Uh, I talked to you earlier about the malnutrition problems that we've seen. And, you know, it's, it, it's really cool to watch the kids that come in with malnutrition. And within two or three weeks, of vi you know, we get all the kids' vitamins and bananas every day and the food. And within two or three weeks, you see that skin color darken, you know. You see the eyes, the eyes widen. widen and get uh, a little more focused. Uh, the second component, of course, is education. We've already talked a lot about that. English, because that will give them a, a leg up on, on the competition, so to speak, when it comes time to either enter university or enter the job market. Uh, the third component is the uh, values and social skills. We think that's just as important as being well educated. We have ten principles that are up on the wall. I'll show you outside. And most importantly, we apply them, we apply them with unconditional love and absolute respect. Within these walls, we've created this atmosphere of safety, of learning, of family. I tell the kids all the time, that's your brother, don't treat him like that. So we've created a, a, an atmosphere of hope. But most importantly, we've created an atmosphere of love. I think team with them just basically plug that family in with that sponsor child. I think one of the big factors there is that communication and them actually feeling I make a difference this child's life. Oh yeah, that'd be great. Thank awesome. you. Thank you. So, what a day. We um, spent the whole day working with uh, the group at Education Plus. I um, met beautiful man Jim, who's um, been working with them for the last six or seven years. We uh, found out really what they needed. Um, they've got over a hundred kids that they feed every single day. I mean, this is the poorest village in the poorest country in all of Latin America. So, I mean, these guys are sleeping on mud floors. Um, there's no bedding whatsoever. So we really asked, how can we help? What can we do to, to help you help more people and, and make a bigger impact? So we decided that the Financial Freedom Foundation, we're gonna donate 5,000 US dollars to them to help provide food for these kids, um, which certainly will be a huge, huge help for them. And we also decided that um, each and every week we're going to commit to sponsoring a child and paying for their education for their whole school career. So that's over 50 kids that we're sponsoring each and every year, um, which is just a beautiful gift for not only the child, but also to take a huge, huge weight off the education plus is cash flow. We can come in, sponsor a kid every single week, 
for their whole education um, from the start of their schooling all the way through to college. Well, I know where you are.